Welcome to Colombia, the best beach hotels close to Cartagena on Barú and the Rosario Islands. Welcome, wonderful people all over the world. My name is Frank. I'm Swiss and I came to Colombia in 2015 and I run a travel agency in Bogota. The last couple of days I went to Barú and the Rosario Islands. I hired some local guides and their little boat and I visited about a dozen hotels. So today I show you this great complimentary plan you should take in account when coming to Cartagena because here in Cartagena the beaches are not good but just 45 minutes an hour boat ride or a car ride down there to Rosario Barú you will find paradisaic Caribbean beaches with golden sand and blue purple water just amazing and that you have a good idea and make the right choice I will show you about a dozen hotels I visited. But before jumping into the video, very important, down in the description sections, you will find all the links of the hotels. So you can book them right away. Also, there are links to my website and the relevant blogs. And there you find also great information all about Colombia. And now we are producing great content. And actually my website is brand new. So check it out. I hope you like the design. So let's jump into the video and visit those hotels. Let's go. Let's start on the Peninsula Baru with the best and also most expensive hotel the Hotel Las Islas on Barú. I actually did not visit this hotel during that trip, but stayed there last year for two nights. And we have a whole video on our channel about it. If you are looking for the most luxurious place in the area, this is it. Hotel Las Islas is embedded in the natural environment and consists of over 50 bungalows. Some are tree houses and some are next to the shore, including private pools. If you go there, I recommend one of those. The hotel also has a private beach, several restaurants, library, gym, and you either can get around with a bike or a call for a golf cart. Isla del Encanto. Isla del Encanto invited me one night and I can truly recommend this hotel. They have 16 rooms from standard to bungalow, junior suite and luxurious master suites. There are two pool areas and some zones are only for hotel guests and others are also open to day visitors. Isla del Encanto has their own beach, there is a spa and local guides are always around to organize trips for you. In this place you receive a complete offer and will never be bored. I can recommend it to everybody. Aura Hotel Barú. The Aura is also a great hotel on Barú. They have 16 rooms. I was not able to enter them as they were all occupied. There is a private beach and a nice bar with tables to have lunch and dinner. From there you can actually see Cholon, the party place. If you are on a day trip just to the islands with a private boat, you should consider to have lunch there. But call in beforehand. Baru Playa Eco Beach Resort. This hotel was a private residence and today offers 9 rooms. The rooms are nice and the sand beach looks very inviting. In this hotel you also will experience a good privacy as it is small and cozy. When I arrived the owners who live in Cartagena 
were on site checking the food for the upcoming season and it looked delicious. Baru Playa Eco Beach Resort is a good option to stay. Playa Escondida This used to be a hotel, but now it is a house to rent entirely. There are four rooms and the common area is quite spacious. There is no own beach, but a lot of privacy. It is a good option for some days with friends and family. Hostal Isla Luna This hostel has 10 rooms and is focused on backpackers and people with lower budget. There is a private beach and facilities are good. The rooms are equipped with mosquito nets. We now go over to the Rosario Islands. I visited Isla Grande and Isla del Pirate. San Pedro de Majagua San Pedro de Majagua is one of the nicest places on Rosario Islands. They offer 17 rooms in categories Superior, Junior Suite and Suite. The rooms also have hammocks on their terraces, which I find very cool. The area is quite big and you can find two different beaches with beach bars and enough space to relax. Gente de Mar Resort Already walking into the hotel is nice. There is art and decoration everywhere. There are different types of rooms from double to suite to family and bungalows. There are also two different beaches, a beach bar and another bar and a big dining zone. It is a great beach hotel to stay or if you only decide on a day trip, this would be one of my favorites for a nice beach day. Isla del Sol The hotel Isla del Sol is also a great destination. It is based in a bay off the island. They have a gated swimming area, but there is also the whole bay. Besides that, there is a pool, bar and nine rooms in different categories. Isla del Sol is small and cozy, but one of my favorites. Isla del Pirata The hotel Isla del Pirata actually has its own island. How cool is that? There are 12 rooms in categories suites and bungalows. The area or let's say the little island is quite big. There is no sand beach but this does not prevent anybody from swimming. Eco Hotel Isla Bella The Eco Hotel Isla Bella is also a great option. The beach is very nice and it is a perfect place for some swimming. The restaurant is directly on the shore. They also have four cabins to stay and some with private beach. Isla Bella is also a destination I can recommend just for a day trip. Isla Lisamar The hotel Isla Lisamar is probably the best place for families with kids. There is a big water slide and also within the hotel they have flamingos. There is a pool, playground and lots of space for day tourists. There are also some rooms and you can stay the night. So, thank you for tuning in, I hope you liked my video. If you have comments or you already have some experiences from the islands, please write them down in the comment section so other travelers can profit from your inside information. And if you like the video also, give me a like, hit it, hit the like button, that's good for the algorithm. And don't forget the description sections with all the links of the hotels. And if you want to travel Colombia, I'm more than happy to help. And I hope to see you soon here on exactly this channel or even better here in Colombia. All the best from Cartagena. Here's Colombia Frank. Bye bye.